We'll vlog it up and I'm enjoying some salami on um, Italian bread with uh, some balsamic vinegar. Hey guys, we're going for a walk. Don't forget about me. <laughs> <laughs> It's really breezy out today. It's actually chilly. And I have shorts on. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see. I should have wore pants. Every time I wear pants, I should wear shorts. And when I wear shorts, I should wear pants. And also, I want to say that I feel extremely blessed that I have a job that allows me to have this time. To yeah, this is pretty cool. Get to go for a little walk the and then. Nice. But this is a fall day, and then it's supposed it to is. get hot the See, rest now, of the day. See, this is not too bad. If it would stay like this, like a little cool, you need a light jacket. No? Yeah, yeah. This, I would like it to stay like this. I don't like the two extremes too hot or too cold. Just yeah. like it's comfortable. I agree. Even though it's just very right now. I'm freezing. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. I am freezing. <laughs> Show them your shirts. Oh. Shorts. And I have a tank top on, and I decided to put a sweatshirt at least. I showed them my shorts oh, already. Did. Yeah, they are again. I got long pants, so. And I am freezing. He told me it's only 66, it's warm out. Mm -hmm. Right. <coughs> and we're not really in the sun, maybe we can well, it's gonna get, walk across yeah, the street and go in the sun. Cool, uh, warmer this week. Yeah. I think it's going back to the 80s or something. Yeah, that's what stinks Let's about see. this whole thing. Yeah, look at this. Is it's going back so to the 80s? 77, then Thursday's 81. That's stinks. And then high 70s for the rest of the week until next week. So. That's why I can't breathe half the night, probably. Change in weather, yeah. but all right. I could just stand right here in the sun a few yeah, minutes. Okay. So I am going to make some apple turnovers from scratch, and I just finished cutting, peeling, and coring the apples. So it took me a good 45 minutes to do eight of them, eight small ones. Uh, so I'm gonna start mixing the ingredients, and I guess I'll show you guys the finished product. Well, guys, I don't know. I think I made way too many apples and I don't know what to do. None of them look like apple turnovers, but I'm gonna just brush some milk and a little sugar on top, and then I'm um, gonna pop those in the oven, and hopefully they taste better than they look. I'm in a cooking mood tonight. It's bedtime. I'm gonna go up and do stuff with. And I forgot to show you guys the apple turnovers when they were done. Yeah. They Dangerous. tasted all right. Not bad. Okay. He said they were delicious. I'm glad he enjoyed them. They were good. They weren't as sugary as normal, but I enjoyed it. It was good. And uh, they didn't come out the right shape, but they taste okay. So that's all that matters. And um, true. Just took all my pills, gonna do my cephaly in bed and go to sleep. Yep. Good night. Get ready for work tomorrow. Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It is Wednesday night and um, <clears throat> Irizario just ran out to uh, pick up a prescription from the pharmacy. And um, we ran to the food store. We had to get applesauce, baby food, so I can take my pills you're running a little bit low and um we were gonna go to costco and uh we were like the cold cuts there we were gonna get a couple of things but i was feeling a little out of breath so uh, we decided not to and i forgot my costco card at home again with this damn costco card <laughs> it's like becoming a thing that i just forget it or i can't find it and then i was gonna wait online and get a new one but i realized that it's not um I don't have the energy to do it tonight and it's probably not worth it. So um, we'll just go back another day and get a couple of things. But we're gonna go to Starbucks. I almost forgot the debit card inside the machine. <laughs> I was just telling them how I forgot my Costco <laughs> card and wow, we're really bad. We're losing it. Yep. Thank you. He just ran into the bank and uh, 
almost left this debit card in there. But anyway, so we are going to run and grab something from Starbucks and then head home and start my therapy and do my nebulizer and everything. Mm. And today has been a little stressful because, uh, you know how I mentioned to you guys, we thought we had everything figured out with my um, enzymes with the prescription. Well, I was <clears> using the mail order pharmacy and um, they were out of stock. So I decided to switch the prescription locally to CVS and they're out of stock. And obviously I need these medications in the order to eat and my enzymes. So um, I got off the phone with my doctor's office a couple hours ago and we are going to transfer the script now to a Walgreens <coughs> in Manhattan that uh, they have connections with uh, getting the CF meds. So, and then they'll overnight those to me. So hopefully they should have it all in stock and um, we should get that figured out. This is going on for like over a month now, month and a half. And from switching insurances, it's just been confusing. So hopefully by tomorrow we can get that resolved. So I was just uh, a little stressed because I received a message from CVS and I was told yesterday that they would have them today. And I receive a message saying, oh, we're not going to have until next week, and they're only going to have part of the order in, so. I think I'm going to have to ditch CVS for those, and we'll go with Walgreens, and, uh, yeah, hopefully that'll get figured out tomorrow. Rosario's busy over here doing some calculation or something on his phone, I don't know. You but we're going to drive. Oh, he's making payments. We're going to drive and go <clears throat> grab something at a Starbucks, and I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so guess what time it is? It's not pill time. Can you guess what time it is? <laughs> <laughs> We're cooking, but it's Toby time. Toby time, Toby time. <laughs> Years ago, I did um, a segment for um, Novartis, which create, uh, is the pharmaceutical company for Toby, Tobermycin inhalation which is an inhaled antibiotic, and so the website was called tobytime.com, which they wound up doing away with, and they brought it back, and anyway, I'm obviously no longer on the website, because that was like 11 years ago, but ever since then, every time I have to do Toby, I say it's Toby time, so it is Toby time, time. and then it's <laughs> pasta time. Pasta time, Toby time, pasta time, pasta. pill time. You got a lot of times going on sauce here. Right here. Check it out. Mm. Delicious. We are pasta people. Not saying it's healthy, but we like it. I'm back and I'm exhausted. Me and Rosario literally spent like two and a half, three hours just cleaning up. We had a lot of papers to go through, things to shred. Um, stuff in our closet that we had to get rid of and just and we also found old expired medication there was quite a bit of that so I have a whole bag inside right now in the closet of that so we just um, <clears throat> been going through our stuff I'm feeling a little out of breath and uh, having some chest tightness again so I think I'm going to do an inhaler so that should help and um, it's pill time Yes, we went from Toby time to cleaning time, eating time, and now it's pill time again. So yeah, it's uh, 1 a.m. So I'm gonna, I'm having a little snack here, a little Danish ring from Holterman's Bakery. Anybody from Staten Island, you guys know that Holterman's has some delicious stuff. So I'm enjoying some of that. And I'm gonna take some insulin and do my pills. And then I'm going to go up to my Cephaly and go to sleep because this girl is exhausted. So, hope you guys are having a wonderful week and um, just a couple of days away from the weekend and Friday. So, that's a good thing, I guess. And um, see you guys in the morning. Good night, guys. Good morning. So, um, I just finished having some cereal for breakfast and um, I've been doing a lot of coughing the last couple of days. I thought I was feeling better, but I don't know. A lot of dark, nasty mucus is coming up from my, I can feel it from my left lung. So, I don't know. Anyway, 
Yesterday I received a shipment of my Dexcom supplies, which is my uh, continuous glucose monitor, which from having insurance uh, changes I wasn't able to get for a couple of months. It was like impossible finding a distributor that I could go to that works with my insurance. Anyway, finally I found it and um, I got the delivery yesterday. So I'm excited to be hooking that back up and um, that'll help regulate my sugar a lot better because I'll be able to see where the problems are and it was helping it was doing me some good and helping get my uh, hemoglobin A1c down which for those of you who don't know that's the um your average sugar over three months so um that uh that has been running high for me for quite a while now and the last I would say like last year to six months six months to a year rather I'm reversing my words my A1C has been coming down little by little but with the sensor having the continuous glucose monitor it was really helping and so um while the time that I didn't have that uh because of the insurance change I um Little by little, I saw my numbers starting to go up again. So I'm happy to have that back. So that'll be good that I'll be able to put that on today. Right now I am pairing it with my transmitter. Uh, and, um, cause it pairs Bluetoothly. So I'll get that all hooked up. I know I've shown you guys that plenty of times. And um, that'll be good. So I'll get that going this afternoon. It takes about three hours two to three hours to get everything hooked up. So that'll be going and uh, hopefully that'll help me get my sugar numbers better. Cause I definitely need uh, improvement. Hey guys, it is almost bedtime having a late dinner. Um, I made a BLT. This is my second one like this. I am pretty hungry. The prednisone hunger is real. And I spoke to Doc a little while ago because I've just been coughing a lot. And we're going to stay on the, um, the oral antibiotic for now and the prednisone on a low dose. So, <clears throat> sorry, I'm pretty sure the hunger will continue. So I am going to finish eating uh, this delicious sandwich. Rosario is making a sandwich for himself. And uh, he just got home from work a little while ago. Got in a little later tonight, so we're just gonna have something to eat and then do my normal routine and head to bed. So, uh, I hope all you guys have a good night. 